Today, my friends, in this new episode of the Early Shift Mise en Place, we're gonna make the pineapple gum syrup. It will take 24 hours to prepare the fruity, silky smooth liquid gold, but believe me, the zero waste version of the syrup will take your tropical cocktails to the next level. First, we're gonna start with a clean pineapple. That's important because we're gonna use the skin. Then we cut off the top, the skin, you can be a bit generous with the flesh you keep on, and also make sure to remove the core or the heart of the fruit. This thing is packed with flavor. Now we will weigh the heart and the skin we took to determine how much sugar we want to add. I had just above 400 grams of fruit, so I'm adding 200 grams of demerara and 200 grams of white sugar. What's important here is we want to have the same amount or just a little less, but don't add more sugar than you have fruit. Then, using a modeler, we will press lightly on the pineapple to kickstart the extraction process. Also, take a second to place all the pieces of pineapple that are at the surface with the flesh facing towards the bottom. This will help the sugar dissolve more easily. So let's set that aside for now and let's start preparing the gum. I like my pineapple gum syrup with a 15% gum to sugar ratio. That means for my 400 grams of sugar, I will need 60 grams of gum arabic powder. To hydrate the powder, we will add the same amount by weight of water and start until we get a smooth mixture that will look like this. Then you're gonna cover that as well and leave both mixture resting at room temperature for 24 hours. In the meantime, if you want to juice some of that delicious pineapple, not a bad idea, we're gonna need some for our cocktails Friday. 24 hours later, it's time to finish that golden deliciousness. As you can see, it's already looking pretty good. The sugar extracted the juice and flavor from the pineapple, but we still have a few more things to do. First, we're gonna remove the fruit pieces one by one by squeezing them to extract all what's left of flavor in there. Then, with a spoon, we're gonna stir a little bit to lift up the undissolved sugar left at the bottom. We're gonna pour that into a new bowl to weight what we have, and using a spatula, make sure to weight all the sugar and every drop of that liquid. Next, we will need some hot water to reach a 1 to 1 ratio. I started with 400 grams of sugar, so I want 400 grams of liquid minus the 60 grams I already have in my gum. So as my mixture now weighs 555 grams, that means I will need 185 grams of water for the perfect ratio. Then we simply pour that over the gum, stir the combine, pour into a sealable container, and store in the fridge until we're ready to use it. And this, my friends, is how we make the delicious zero waste pineapple gum syrup. Now, if you want to take that zero waste concept up a notch, take that upper part of the pineapple, trim the bottom leaf, and place this in water. Change the water every day or so, and in about one month, you will start to see growing some roots. That's when you're going to plant that into soil, and before you know it, you're going to have a beautiful pineapple tree at home. So my friends, this is it for me today. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you like this video, to turn that bell if you want to make sure not to miss the next one. And until then, thank you very much again. Have a great day, and see you very soon. Friday, actually, for some pineapple cocktails. Bye.